Good morning. It is Tuesday morning. Uh, it's kind of cloudy out there. Depends where you are. Uh, we've got a little bit to talk about. We've got some rain in the forecast. It is still winter and there are some scattered showers headed our way. A winter weather advisory in the mountains. Winter storm warning potential for kind of Yosemite South. Uh, scattered showers have already fallen in Northern California. Heaviest rain looks as though it's going to end up Big Sur, Santa Cruz Mountains area. It's kind of in that, up north of Point Conception. But it's like everybody will get something by Wednesday around here. But again, none of this, if you remember what we talked about yesterday, the idea that the precipitable water or the moisture available, the fuel, not really sinking up. It's there, but it's missing these little sparks that will ignite more rain. It doesn't mean we're not going to get wet. It just means we're not going to get as much wet. Uh, surf along the coast has dropped quite a bit, but don't be fooled by that because it ramps its way back up pretty rapidly. So kind of a, yeah, more of a wintry forecast today. We'll get right to it. This is the national map. Like it because... You just go, boom, wow, stuff's going on, right? A lot of wind down in Texas. They have high fire, red flag warnings. They've got some potential tornadic activity up around uh, Arkansas and Louisiana. Uh, lots of wind stuff. These browns represent wind stuff. Remember we talked yesterday about the ice of ours, and then we actually looked at this area, and I said, hey, it's going to be windy tomorrow and maybe the next couple of days. And you can see that's a, that's a huge population of uh, the country uh, under some kind of a advisory watches or warnings, but also just under wind. These oranges are uh, blizzard warnings. These are blizzard warnings up in here. And then you can see some uh, winter storm warnings, a little bit of everything. And then out west, you see, here's our winter weather advisory. And then further south, and that tells you right away that this storm's going to have, these weather events are going to have more of a trajectory kind of in through the central part of the state. Mammoth will do well on this uh, event. And that pink represents a winter storm warning. And that's kind of it. Uh, yeah, that's kind of it. So kind of quiet. Uh, overall, this scattered shower activity is from up around Crescent City, up around Humboldt, pardon me. And you can see just it's raining. That's all I want you to see, live camera. It's raining a little bit up there. This is up at, um, where is this one? This is Cape Mendocino. Right, remember that point that sticks out further north? So they're getting a few scattered showers as of 8.30 in the morning. And then this is Mount Shasta, mm, right? Can't see it, there it is. You can see it back behind the clouds. You see the fog moving in. So Mount Shasta is pretty far south, but it had that weather system has still sitting out on the coast. That's kind of what I wanted to show you. There's scattered showers there. And in San Francisco, uh, this is Golden Gate Park, that big strip. And then there's the mouth of the Golden Gate Bridge. Surface small, we'll look at that. But uh, as far as rain showers, not here yet. And again, what did I just do? I'm taking live cameras and I'm going, oh look, there's raindrops. <laughs> I know, and then you go to the radar and you go, oh look, it's raining right there, right? So that's kind of a, it, it's, it's a good source. The radars are not inaccurate, but sometimes they misread or we misread the radars. And so if you can take a live picture and go, is it raining there yet? No. Is it raining there? Yes. Let's look at the radar. Make sure it shows something. And it, so often I'll see rain on a picture, but no rain from the radar, no green or vice versa. So the showers have showed up. Here is kind of the area we were just in up around Humboldt County, Crescent City, 1700s, two tenths of an inch. So right away you go, Ooh, there's nothing going on here. This weather system doesn't have much game in the north. Uh, 0 0.13, 0 0.06, 0 0.03, Cape Mendocino. That shot we took, this uh, that camera was right out here by this 0.18. So 0.2, that's about as much as we I've seen. And then you go further south, right? So right away, we're that's we're doing storm inventory. What does this thing got game? Well, right now, last time we did this, the rain totals on the north coast were hammering, and they hadn't gotten to the central coast or to Southern California. Um, and that's an indication, oh, this, if it's going to sweep, that, that thing, this thing's got game. This thing, next storm, and you'll see it coming up. Not a lot going on. You do see some showers. I didn't realize, I didn't see this, but there are some west slopes here in Nevada, which makes sense because we are looking for more of a central coast-centric um, kind of a, a, a rain event. But, uh, yeah, so there you go. So, so pretty light so far. Some just slightly different. I don't want to throw you off your game, but... This is a computer model. This is the HRRR, it's a rapid update model. And what I'm gonna do, we're just gonna look at two models. We're gonna look at this, the HRRR, which is, if you look up here, you'll see these are all the different models. It's on the COD website, which is linked to my page. 
And there's the HRRR right there. And then there's the wrap it up there, North American. There's a Euro, there's a GFS, they're all up there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna look at first the rapid, the HRRR for today. So here we go, here we go, here we go. Right now it is Tuesday morning, Tuesday, it updates, it's more granular so that it goes more hour by hour. So here is about now, and then watch what happens to the rain. See, I got a circle around us, right? Boom, gone. So what do you do with that, right? You don't see much going on with that. And then we'll go forward a little bit and then see this area blossom down here? That's, that's, that's the event. And that is Mrs. Northern California. We are now into late Tuesday night, Wednesday morning, and there's your rain event. And then Southern California, you get into it. This is the H triple R. And then you see the instability. So let's look at that again. So here is today. Here's to, no, oh, sorry. Here is today. And then here is nothing. It's a nothing burger or a few sprinkles as we've seen already on the North Coast. And then this area down here blossoms. This is on Tuesday night, Wednesday morning. And that comes into the Santa Cruz Mountains, into San Jose. That's rain. And that's going to be tenth of an inch, quarter inch in the north. Down towards Big Sur, it's going to be an inch, maybe an inch and a half of rain. And then that's your winter storm warning in Mammoth. Okay. And so now that is the HRRR. So let's see. Same time period. Not as granular, so it's not going hour by hour. This is the GFS. And here comes the same model. So it did the same thing, didn't it? Right away. There it is. Tuesday afternoon into Tuesday night. And there comes that development into Wednesday morning. See it? So right, model's pretty good agreement on that. That's kind of awesome. We don't get that all the time. So uh, it feels good. So what it sounds like to me, and then Southern California here is, let's see, Southern California. I, I missed you guys. There you go. Yeah, you're going to get a little into it on Wednesday afternoon. And then again, a lot of a lot of activity further south. So this next series of systems has the potential to be that. So we just did that, right? We know today's kind of a nothing burger. Tomorrow, tonight, tomorrow, it is San Jose South. And that looks to be the main event right now, truthfully, that uh, Saturday, um, uh, tonight, tomorrow. So this is Palisades Tahoe. I wish it would work. It's not working. I'm going to make it work. I'm just going to, this, this is brave but i'm gonna do it say going right to the source see how the sausage is made and there it goes and it's not gonna take again oh there it goes okay so that is um uh, palisades and i know my buddy out there who wishes he could sit by me when i do this he's always like dude why don't i just wish i could sit by you and you do the the, the palisades ski stuff because you don't know where you are and the truth is i ski a lot but i don't really know where i am in terms of the chairlift i can't tell where that is that looks like, I'm not even going to guess because my, my boy's screaming. Oh, it says, uh, it doesn't say. Okay, this is Tahoe up in the mountains. So the mountains, there's not a lot of folks skiing today. This is the road conditions, fine. There will be some scattered snow flurries, but not a big deal. And that winter weather advisory, much less than a winter storm warning, which is further to the south, the Kirkwood south to Bear Valley. That is for tonight and tomorrow. Okay. I'm going to go back at some point. We're going to look at that model real quick again. I want to show you this last picture. Ocean Beach. Uh, no big surf advisory. It's kind of small today. But remember what I said the other day? There's swell lurking out there. It comes back up on Thursday. Pretty good size. Like 8 to 15, 8 to 12. And so that's going to start rippling into this swell over the next mm, couple of days. So it's not a really friendly ocean right now. Let's go back. I want to just, let's do HRRR real quick. And we're going to look at the timing again, just so you can, I can leave you with a good forecast. So here is today, falls apart. This is this afternoon, nada, nada, nada. And then here is tonight, and then you see this flowering down here, right? You, do you see that? This is HRRR. And then here it moves into Santa Cruz, Big Sur. This is Wednesday, Tuesday late, Wednesday morning early. So Wednesday morning, you guys, that's the event. And then there it is, Wednesday mid-morning, Wednesday noon, Wednesday afternoon. Okay, right? So that's how the day looks tomorrow. So this is all, this event seems to be mostly about tonight and tomorrow, even though there will be a few sprinkles as we're seeing up by Oric and in Humboldt County. All right, hope that was enough. I tried to go a little quicker today because we do have some weather. I'll see you back here tomorrow.